Hi everyone, this is Amy Hager here and I'm here to share with you five reasons why fiber helps with rapid weight loss. Okay, reason number one, fiber increases the size and the weight of the stool and it also helps to soften it. So you wanna have those nice firm stools that helps um, to move things on out. So fiber helps to increase the bulk of that. Fiber is essentially like a broom sweeping all of the stuff out of the colon. Reason number two, fiber lowers your cholesterol. So cholesterol is something that your body creates all by itself. So when you're eating a lot of fiber, it helps to lower that cholesterol. It is a non-essential nutrient. Because we make it by ourselves, our liver creates our cholesterol levels, uh, you know, and we are able to sustain that within ourselves. The only reason why we can be getting a lot of extra um, cholesterol is if we're consuming products that have a liver. Also, a lot of those products that have a liver also have no fiber in them. So meat and dairy are two big culprits. They are going to increase your cholesterol a lot and there's no fiber in those two products. So if you start to increase the plants and start to increase your fruits and vegetables, you're gonna to start to notice that your stools are going to come out a lot easier and you won't be constipated as often. So get more fiber, it will help you to reduce your cholesterol. Reason number three, fiber is going to give you healthy bowel movements. You want to be having bowel movements regularly and I know it's a crazy topic to even talk about but you want to be uh, moving that stuff on out. You don't want to be carrying your waste around with you. Uh, I had a teacher that literally was talking about how a huge part of the population is literally full of shit. So you guys eat some fiber. It will help to move things on out. It will help you have healthy bowel movements and that's extremely important for a healthy body. Fiber helps to control your blood sugar, so that fiber is going to slow down the sugar uptake if you're eating fruits and vegetables. So fruits and vegetables have a lot of fiber in them, but because they have that fiber in them, the glucose and the fructose that's in them, all of the natural sugars that are in them, are going to have a slower release of that sugar into the bloodstream. So you can significantly reduce your diabetes symptoms through eating fruits and vegetables, if not completely eradicate it. And number five, Fiber helps to feed that gut microbacteria. So we have little microbacteria within our gut and they feed off of that fiber. So if we are having foods without fiber, then we have, uh, we essentially are destroying our gut uh, microbacteria. We're destroying the gut flora that's in here. And we all know that that's so important. Again, what foods have no fiber in them? Meat and dairy, ah, get rid of it fast. Start eating way more fruits and vegetables and you're going to start to feed those little guys in here that are going to help uh, compost. So think about a compost pile. That compost pile gets broken down because of all the little bugs in there. We want to see a healthy um, microbiology going on with that compost bin. Same thing within our gut bacteria. So we want to have a lot of fiber so it helps to break everything down in here and it helps to move everything on out. So I hope this helps you guys. If you have any questions, please let me know. Comment down below. If you like this channel, please like, subscribe. And if you're a mommy, I have a free ebook, Weight Loss for Moms. Check it out. Sending you guys all my love. Peace out.